If you're like many teachers, you probably have files in both Microsoft Office and Google Drive. In this video, I'm going to show you how to begin moving your files from Office into your Drive account and converting them into Google Docs, Slides, Sheets, etc. Now, I have a file that I recently downloaded. It's a uh, Microsoft Word file on uh, World War II. And right now, that file is sitting here in my downloads folder. And I want to put that in my Drive account. We're going to go over a couple different ways to do this. The most common way and the way that you may have uh, done this in the past is to go into your Drive account, click the New button, and select the File Upload. This will bring you into your files, typically your download folder, where I can select the file, select enter, and that file will be uploaded into my Google Drive account. Now there's one problem with this file in that it is currently a Microsoft Word file in Google Drive. Now I can open the file and I can see it, looks fine, but I'm going to have very limited editing options because this is a Word file, not a Google Doc. Now, one way around this is to select the file, click on the snowman in the top right corner of Google Drive, and go to open with Google Docs. So we're going to open this Microsoft Word file using Google Docs. That will force it to convert into a Google document and give us full editing access to the file um, as you would normally expect. So let's take a quick look at the formatting of the converted file. Uh, looks pretty good. I'll keep scrolling down a little bit. This one looks like it converted uh, pretty well. Oops, there's a little bit of an issue. So uh, sometimes the spacing will adjust. It's probably a slightly different font. So I'll just put a couple of returns in there to uh, put the pagination back where it needs to be. These are the types of edits that you should expect um, to make to a file once it's been converted. Now, I'm not going to sugarcoat this. Some files convert perfectly. Some files convert horribly. It really depends on the features and elements of the document that you are converting. This process works with PowerPoint and Excel files as well. Google Docs and um, uh, Sheets are typically the best conversion from um, Office to Drive. PowerPoint to Google Slides is the one that tends to uh, have the most issues because uh, slides and PowerPoint are so different. Math teachers, you especially will notice um, more errors than other teachers. A lot of the special characters and symbols in math equations uh, have a hard time converting as well. So you just have to kind of test it and see. Now this is one way to convert your file, um, but it does require a couple of steps, a lot of clicks, and it will result in two two copies of the file, the original Word file, and then the converted Google Doc. If it converts well, I'd probably want to go in here and delete the Word file. Now, I'm going to show you another way to do this that will save you some time. To begin, we're going to click on the gear in Google Drive up at the top and go into Settings. We want to look for this button that says Convert Uploads and click that box. What this will do is bypass that second step. So we uploaded the Word file, then we had to click the snowman and say open with Google Docs. With that conversion box checked, the Word file will automatically get converted um, once we upload it. So I'll show you. We'll click on New. We'll go to File Upload. Select the file again from my download folder and it's going to upload and convert all in one step. If your intention is to begin taking your content out of Microsoft Office and move it into Google Drive, this is probably the setting that I would recommend. It'll be much faster and it will avoid having duplicate files in your Google Drive account. Good luck during your conversion. Be patient with it. It does take time um, and you'll need to review the files, but you'll have them uh, safely backed up in your Google Drive account with access from any device that has an internet connection.